Ah, Mr. Donkey, at your service. Though some folks, bless their hearts, still cling to the boring old Anthony. But alchemy, my friends, that's where the real deal is. Forget the kindergarten finger paint explosion you're picturing. No, this love affair with bubbling cauldrons started way before I could even reach the spice rack. Let's just say my first potion involved a neighbor's prized begonia, a questionable amount of glitter, and a desperate attempt to breathe fire like my favorite cartoon dragon. Spoiler alert, resulted in more smoke than actual flames, and a serious lecture on respecting plant life. Baby steps, right? Fast forward a couple decades, and here I am, a master alchemist, mostly. Turns out volunteer hours are a real thing, even at the awesome summer alchemist program at Cal State LA. But fear not, the fire for the perfect potion burns brighter than a disco ball at a troll convention. My creations range from the epic, that near Phoenix summoning potion still gives Zeus nightmares, I bet, to the delightfully useful. Take my latest masterpiece, for example. It utilizes a key ingredient courtesy of the, uh, generous donations of my loyal canine companions. Yep, you heard that right. Turns out, with a little help from a delightfully eccentric Wicca a few towns over and a dash of canine, creativity, even the most unexpected, deposits, can be transformed into something truly, transformative. Here's the kicker, though. Yields and growth patterns in alchemy? Undeniable, dude. You wouldn't believe the potion I whipped up last week from a rogue dandelion and a particularly disgruntled squirrel's stash of nuts. Let's just say it involved temporary levitation and a surprisingly philosophical conversation with a very judgmental garden gnome. The point is, with the right mix of stuff, a sprinkle of elbow grease, and maybe a healthy dose of delusion, the possibilities are endless. Imagine the power locked away in a pebble, the hidden magic in a forgotten rhyme, or the potent energy radiating from, well, let's just say some strategically placed dog droppings. Deep. Right? So, next time you see smoke billowing from my chimney, or hear a suspiciously enthusiastic chorus of barks from my backyard, don't panic. It's just Mr. Donkey, here to remind you that magic can be found in the most unexpected places. Especially under a dog, apparently. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a cauldron bubbling with, well, let's just say it involves moonlight, questionable life choices, and the unwavering belief that this time, I will definitely breathe fire. Wish me luck, and maybe bring a fire extinguisher, just in case. Alchemy is a path paved with wonder, and the occasional, spectacularly smoky mishap.